Hey guys, Jim here from Drink a Beer, Play a Game, and yes, it is another game for Yokoi Kids, which is a Game Boy of the Month Club run by this guy named Rick and Ian from the Completely Unnecessary Podcast. And what they do is they pick a classic Game Boy game, mostly from the original era, and they spotlight it, whether it's any kind of content, reviews, gameplay videos, music remixes, whatever you want. And they spotlight a different game. So I like it because it lets me take a deeper look at the Game Boy Library, which I didn't get to do as a kid. And today's game is going to be a late entry because it's April or May. I'm recording this in April. I'm a little lazy, might not get this up until May. So you never know. But February's game was this, Balloon Kid. And at the time, I didn't own this. And how I actually wound up getting this was with the same bundle that I got Burger Time Deluxe. So this goes for about 15 bucks at least on its own at this point. And thanks to the bundle, I got it for about 7 bucks. So that's a definite win for me there. What this is is the sequel to Balloon Fight on the NES, which was a remake of Swords of Joust for the Atari. Uh, I forget who originally did the arcade. I'm hoping it's Atari. But uh, either way, so they actually put a little bit of storyline into this. It expands on the original gameplay, and people really seem to like it. Uh, I've only messed around with it for maybe 5-10 minutes at this point. Figured I'd do another full-on first impression kind of let's play, so let's pop this in and take a look. Alright, so here we go. Going to be starting Balloon Kid. Sing Balloon Trip? Single, Single player. Start, start, start. I'm um, playing again on my Retron using the Super Nintendo controller. Uh, it's actually kind of funny because on the Retron it's giving me some color. And when you play it on the Game Boy itself, like my Game Boy Advance, it doesn't give any like specific color. So A little different than uh, how Burger Time was just straight with the gray. Uh, this almost does what uh, Kix did as far as color goes. Uh, do, 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 do. I love, 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 love the music in this first level. It is really like a... That is a weird little glitch going on in the side there. I don't know if I just never noticed it before. Like, you'll notice it on the left-hand side with the balloons. I, n I don't know if I ever noticed it on my Game Boy if it's just something weird with the uh, Retron emulation. I could use my uh, Game Boy Advance player, but I don't know. The picture's never quite as pretty on the GameCube. I have the HDMI adapter. You should check out my review of that. It's actually a good device, but eh, whatever. Retron just makes it easier for doing this kind of crap. Uh, but yeah, this is another one of those games that I got in that five-game uh, bundle a while back, so... I was fortunate about that, and since this is one of the games that people picked, I decided... What the hell, these Let's Plays are easy content, so... And it gives me an excuse to actually sit down and play it. I do hear that this is not the hardest game in the world, which, with the little bit, I've put about maybe 15 minutes into a total so far. I uh, haven't had too much trouble, but... I think it's like, what, is it only eight episodes, maybe? Or episodes, eight levels? These bonus stages take forever, too. It's kind of cool to see, like, a game with a physics engine like this working so well on the Game Boy, though. Physics engine, momentum, whatever you want to call it. It's just, like, one of those nice, relaxing kind of games. Then again, however the game goes later on, uh, we shall see. So I don't know what the point of... I think the story is... Alice, the main character, her brother floated away on the balloon, so she has to collect all of his, follow his balloon trail to find him and get him back. And then you need all these balloons to get one-ups and to pilot your own balloons? Something like that. Yeah, invincibility. The only problem is on my TV right now, I have it muted, so it's not messing with my uh, voiceover. And it gives you a nice little, you know... Audio, it gives you a nice little musical signal for when the, ah shit, whatever, for when the boost is running out. So, I'm not going to know when that's done, which is always fun. Oh, I guess the second you miss one of the, uh, one of the doubles, then it all just goes away, 
I guess that's what happened there. Not entirely sure. Ooh, grab, 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 grab. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Alright. So I do know enough that, uh, I have to go down here. And just hammering away at the bottom button brings the balloons back. Or bottom button. Hitting down. That is a dumb way to say, oh, crap, 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 crap. Do I have enough time? Pump, 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 pump. All right. So if you get hit once, you lose one balloon. Get hit twice, you lose both balloons, you fall, you die. Simple enough. Stage one, done. Not the hardest thing in the world. You get boss fights in this game, they happen every other round. So, every other stage you get a boss fight. I think there's only four boss fights in the whole game. I did listen to the uh, podcast that the guys had. They actually run a pretty good podcast, and like I said in my last video, it's only like 15 minutes long per game, so... It's not a big time investment, and it gives you a nice little rundown of the game, and people's impressions, and whatever any of the entries were, so... Obviously missed the boat on that, because I didn't own the game until now, but... Um, you know, I'm getting down and being able to play it. So I think it's, what is it, when you hit 20 or 25? Alright, those are spikes. Don't want to do that. Don't want to hit the spiders either. Yeah. The only thing I don't like is that, like, I'm always so close to the left edge, which I just know is going to bone me in one of these later levels. Got a little penis with that spider there. Get up. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, all right. She bounced off it. Cool. Yeah, I definitely like these games that Yokoi Kids uh, puts out there just because I really did miss the boat as a kid on the freaking Game Boy. So. Ooh, ooh. Careful. All right, all right, Dick. So just having the ability... Alright, so it's 20, where that comes into play. So just having the ability to just, you know, play through these games that I never got to play through before. And it's another library, and like, you know... Rick and Ian, they pick games that are cheap, so you're not gonna kill your... And there's so many goddamn games on the Game Boy, too, that like... You can afford to just go after some random ones. Uh... I probably could have gotten that one up. I probably would have had to, like, gear to my balloons and try and wheedle my way in there, but whatever. Invincibility. All right, let's, let's do this. Get some points. Get some points. Make my way to the edge. Bypass balloons. Why not? Kill the spiders. Now, I wonder if the music eventually loops. I'm not even going to know until I watch the replay of this video with the gameplay. But, uh... Man, the music's so good. I, like... I, I hope the music from the first stage comes back. That's what I'm really hoping for. Alright, that seems like a weird spot for that. Ooh, crap, 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 crap. There we go. Ooh, 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 ooh. Ooh, ooh, ho, ho, ho. Dirty, 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 dirty. Oh, crap. Crap, 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 crap. Alright, the stage has definitely gotten longer. I will give it that. Took me a lot longer to get to the bonus stage. These bonus stages, though, man, they get friggin' oh, come on. They get boring fast. They're not bad. Don't get me wrong, they're not bad stages. Ooh. Getting a little penisy with it. They're not bad at all, it's just boring. Like, they could have made these a lot quicker. But maybe that's just the fact that these early ones are so easy.
And get the heart. Cool. More lives. More lives are always welcome. Because... Like I said, I hear the game... Oop. Shit. Come on. I guess... Ooh, crap. I hear the game's easy, but... I can neither confirm nor deny how easy the later stages get. Oh, okay. Boss fight time. Oh, there's the brother. Bye. Now, if I remember right... Maybe those weren't spikes down there? I don't know. Stage two clear. How long did that take? Maybe took like eight minutes, if that, to get through the first two stages. So, might not be a long game. I don't know. I don't know how many continues you get. Uh, hopefully I don't have to get to that point. Maybe I can actually beat a game. That'll be nice. Oh, it's moving faster. Cool. Oh, hey. You... You don't do that. You stop that. Oh, shit. Oh, oh, God. Oh, all right. It's getting a little tighter. Nice little well in the background. Some, uh, some locals. Ooh. Ooh, 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 boy. I have a feeling I'm going to need that, especially with one balloon. Oh, I'm going to need that, too. Get back here. Gotcha. Oh, my God! Hmm. I got penisy with the, uh... Got a little penisy with the, uh... With the blowing balloons back up. Ooh, cool. Jeez. The islands do not give you a lot of opportunity for that. Lesson learned. Come on. Ooh, crap, 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 crap. Just in time. Just, uh, and I lose it right away. Crap. Oh, uh, it's not good. Ooh. Get up. <laughs> Alright, I wasn't expecting that. No, don't jump right on the frugging bird. Oh, Jesus. Okay. I've hit a bit of a snag. Stay low. Stay low. Weather the storm, Jim. Weather the storm. Oop. What's that points? What's that points? Ding. Am I done the stage? Please tell me I'm done the stage. <laughs> Started bleeding out there at the end. Crap. Got one life back. Yeah, I was not expecting that. So I think... I'm at the halfway point now of the game. A little over 10 minutes in. I'm sure all those teeth up top are no good. Inside the belly of a whale. So. At least it varies up the uh, settings for you. And I'm guessing that was the fish from Mario 3. The one that ate me. Or maybe a fish from Mario. I don't know. I'm not enough of a Nintendo kid to know these things. 
these little Easter eggs. But, uh, yeah, graphically, the game, it's alright. I mean, I don't know what to compare it to with the Game Boy, but... I mean, the sprites are nice and colorful, and... They're big enough, you can see everything. The music, like I said before, I like it a lot. I like the control! I do like the control. It takes a little bit of getting used to, but... Ha ha ha. Ha 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 I could've used that heart. I could've used that heart. Alright. I'll sacrifice getting that one to get this one. That's fine. Let's see how tough the, uh... Because I missed the bonus stage in the last level, so... Let's see how tough it gets in this game. It's over as soon as you one gets popped. Oh, that's not good. I think my days of getting uh, bonuses. Ooh, go away, fishy! Damn it! I think my days of getting bonus lives from that game are gonna be numbered here. I need a platform to build my thing back up. Can we end up? I should have used that to build my... Here we go. Wow, they give you two bonus levels in this one. Maybe look, stage three didn't have any bonus stages in it? I don't know. Ooh, come on. Get over there. Bounce off the wall. Get down, stupid. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, no, this is getting... It's getting bad. <sighs> no! Ah, damn it. All falling apart. Fell apart. Yeah, there may be a time where I get a little distracted here because my, uh... My kid is sleeping upstairs right now, so... Get back there, get back there, get back there, get back there. Yes! So if I miss her, if I miss anything because of that, you know why. Oh, that part would have sucked. That part would have sucked real bad without the uh, invincibility. The teeth can pop the balloons. It is confirmed. Teeth can pop balloons. Fuel can melt steel beams. Things have been discovered tonight. And I... Mm, 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 that's not... Ooh. I think it took a little pity on me there. Oh, there's my brother. Where's he going? Alright, so I guess I have to... God damn it. With one hit left, I miss the... With one hit left, I miss it. Not good. Could have been a life I could have saved. Yes, brother of mine. Yes, little brother.
myself the little safety cushion there. Careful. And that's what I should have done the first time. These boss fights are not hard. These boss fights are not hard. I was just a stupid head. I was a stupid baby. Alright, got six lives. I'm on stage five. Second half of the game. Outside of the whale. Ooh, green. See, you even get weather effects in this game. Is there nothing this game can't do? Honestly. Oh, wow. What the? Oh, the rain pushes you down. Haha. -ha. So I have to be strategic about this approach. And my friend, Mr. Asshole Fish, ate my balls. Well, I mean, she's a girl, so ate my clam? Oh no. Character's probably a little too young to be saying anything like that, so. Oops. Ah, uh, how my father. <laughs> Who let this happen? I thought I avoided that lightning. Guess I didn't. Oh, it shoots thingies at you, too. Isn't that cute? All right. Cute, cute. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, I'm dropping like flies here. Do not shock me. Do not shock me, Mr. Mean Lightning. Mr. Mean Lightning that follows me. For Christ's sakes. Alright, I guess that was enough to not get killed by that? Alright. Alright, so this is the uh, part that's like Balloon Trip from uh, Balloon Fight. <laughs> oh. Extra life and invincibility. I could have saved my balls a little bit there. See, this is where my lack of experience with balloon fights coming to bite me in the ass. No continues. Alright, well. These are meant to be first impression stream or streams. First impression let's plays, so I guess this is where it ends. But all right, I got through a little over half the game. Fun game! Doesn't seem like the hardest thing in the world. Um, I bet if I put some more time into it, I could probably beat it. Oh, here's a quick cut. Uh, it turns out they do give you a continue, so... I could have kept going, but I'm a dummy and didn't click the button, so... Anyway, you do get at least one continue. I don't know if you can gain more. Whatever, but like I said, fun game. Uh, this is one... like. What am I, uh, maybe 20 minutes in, and I'm a little over, I'm in level 5, so, probably could have beaten the stage if I hit that extra life in that power-up thingy, but, whatever. But a fun game, uh, one that I, you definitely have to get used to the control with it, you gotta take your time, be way more patient than I was, but, if you find it out there, definitely pick it up. I mean, if you're a big Balloon Fight fan, I don't see a reason why you wouldn't pick this up, 15 bucks ain't bad, if you're a general Game Boy fan, why not? Uh, for a guy like me who, like, if I didn't get it in a bundle, I probably wouldn't have paid 15 bucks for it, but now that I have it for 7 bucks, I think that's a good buy. So, if you can find it for, like, less than 10 bucks, definitely hop on that. Uh, let me know below if you've ever played Balloon Kid before, how much you like it, how bad I apparently am at it, and, you know, if you have any more Game Boy games or just general suggestions for Let's Plays, because... Sometimes it's just nice to sit down and dick around with a game I haven't really spent a lot of time with. So, uh, remember, hit that like, subscribe if you haven't yet, leave comments below, 
And as always, links to Patreon will be below, as well as the Power Hour podcast, which is also on iTunes. So, till next time, guys. Cheers.